Full time in Germany, Freiburg 1, West Ham United. Neil, that was really, really poor, wasn't it? I mean, I'll come to the decision at the end in just a second. But if we talk about the game itself, the game plan baffled me. I'm going to be totally honest. Look, to an extent, you've got to be a little bit streetwise in these European games. And, and look, the West Ham players are on the pitch pr- protesting uh, that decision at the end. But we shouldn't have been in that position if we're being totally honest with ourselves. We had chances and we would have, we would have had even more chances if we'd have just been a little bit more progressive and smelt blood especially about 10 or 15 minutes into that second half where we had Freiburg pretty much where we wanted them but just couldn't convert uh, in the final third we weren't proactive enough there wasn't enough urgency there it seemed like we were playing at like 75 or 80 percent tonight that it didn't seem too much a hint of complacency complacency in there which bemused me slightly and um, yeah that performance as a whole infuriated me but I'll tell you what's infuriated me even more is that at the end that took four minutes I mean if that's not a penalty we just as well not bother I'm not being funny his I know it's at a close proximity from where he kicks the ball I think it was it Suchek kicks the ball but his arm is up here and they might have different rules in UEFA I'm not entirely sure but that is an unnatural position that's what they said on commentary and then when the referee went to the monitor he, he looked at it on several occasions and he's just trying to explain it to David Moyes now the referee on the pitch but honestly I I don't know how he's come to that conclusion with your arm up here it's a penalty every single day of the week and he went and he did the old box signal and I thought there we go penalty and then he went like that and I, I was in utter disbelief I'm like how was he not given that as a penalty? I think we've been absolutely robbed there. You know, I don't like to blame referees and VAR too much very often, but I mean you can't you can't sway away from that whatsoever. It's a penalty and we've been yeah, we've been really hard done by there, but we shouldn't have put ourselves in that position. We should have had that game wrapped up. We should have been one or even two goals up uh, in the tie. And in the end, we were too comfortable and it came back to um, bite us on the backside and we paid the price in the end. And we've now got to recover a one goal lead away from, uh, sorry, uh, uh, we've got to recover a one goal lead at home next week at the London Stadium. We've given ourselves an uphill battle. Listen, I don't think they were fantastic Freiburg tonight. So I think if we can play uh, to the best of our ability next week, I think we can get past these and we can beat them. But it's a bit of a wake up call tonight for that team for Moyes um, and for everybody involved not good it wasn't a good performance we probably didn't deserve to definitely didn't deserve to win the game a draw maybe uh, and obviously we'll feel like we probably should have got that at the end but it is what it is we've got to take it on the chin and move on um well, what does he do on Sunday now? Does he prioritise next Thursday and rest players? I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, underwhelmed with that tonight. Disappointed as well. But that's it from me. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. SC Freiburg 1, West Ham nil. The first leg is done. Narrow defeat for the Hammers. Disappointing. And now we move on to next week. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.